So neural feedback has that same base. It's you work with a technician who's trained in cognitive behavioral therapy and neural feedback. And, and, you know, you do some EEG to try to see which area of the brain we're going to try to stimulate. So it is that same thing. The only thing the TMS, um, leverages electricity. Nikolai Tesla said that in the late 1800. If you want to understand the universe, you need to think in terms of energy. Our body communicates via energy. That's quantum mechanics. So you stimulate energy and that energy t- turns into an electric signal, a magnetic field that depolarizes our nerve cells and then does muscle contraction, does new nerve connections. So it is the same principle as neural feedback, somewhat different because there you, 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 um, you use energy. But at the end of the day, what you're trying to do, it's neuroplasticity new connections of the brain, having areas of the brain that did not connect before to connect, stimulating the prefrontal cortex. Specifically in uh, in TMS, we stimulate that specific area that's called the dorsolateral prefrontal cortex. Again, that's the executive room of the executive boardroom. This is the area that is specifically responsible for high order executive function, for emotional regulation, for cognitive um, uh, power. So when you stimulate that and you make that area become um, more active, that's when you get more cognitive function out of it. <laughs>